For more than 19 years, Yank Berry has devoted his life to helping others. He founded the not-for-profit organization Global Village Champions in 1995, along with wife Yvette and partner and friend Muhammad Ali. The organization has thus far provided nearly one billion meals to hungry people around the world. He has now also begun the mission of helping refugees from places such as Syria, Iraq, and Iran escape from religious persecution. Yank's efforts were recognized recently when Mr. Berry was nominated for the Nobel Peace Prize, not just once, but three years in a row. Not too bad for a man who started off his career in 1968 as the lead singer of a rock band called The Kingsmen. They would go on to record the classic song, Louie Louie. A year later, he would become president of McConnell Records, and in 1971, would even record a rock opera entitled The Diary of Mr. Gray. Yank started some of his early philanthropic endeavors during his music career. He put on concerts for various causes, helping countless people with his efforts on behalf of drug prevention, social causes, and hunger. In 1990, Yank founded VitaPro Foods and developed a soy-based meat replacement product, which has become the leader in the soy industry and is being sold globally. It was Yank's entry into the food industry at VitaPro that would change his life and the lives of countless other people forever. He soon started donating his product to various charities in Canada and the U.S. Yank has been compared to Oskar Schindler with his efforts in helping in the Syrian refugee crisis. He has so far managed to save over 1,400 individuals, getting them out of harm's way and into a safe house in Bulgaria. He has also convinced heads of state in Sweden, Canada, Norway, and Germany to let these refugees find shelter in those countries and start a new life there. Yank and Yvette Berry have traveled thousands of miles, putting themselves in harm's way to save people's lives and feed the children. They truly are an inspiration to us all, and we are proud to honor them with the Child Help International Achievement Award for 2015. I'm here to thank my best friend who has supported me for over 23 years, she stays off camera, she does all the work, answers all the letters, cooks the food in the jungle, cooks the food in tsunamis. Um, she's always been there, and this is her time. She's the love of my life, my best friend, my wife, Yvette Barry. I got lucky. <laughs>